Aaron, come here a second. Aaron Wilburn, give Aaron a good hand. Well, here we are in Louisiana. I love the South. Cause it's a place where you can say whatever you want to about people. As long as you say bless his heart. <laughs> Sir, you can say awful things about people. It's the ugliest man I've ever seen in my life. Bless his heart. <laughs> Talk about how lazy they are. That's the laziest woman God ever created. Bless her heart. <laughs> the other day I was on an airplane. and Actually, I wasn't on the airplane. I was in it. Do you know what owning an airplane would do to you? It would take your face to the back of your neck and you'd have to reach around here just to blow your nose. Well, I had the middle seat. I didn't want the, the middle seat. I wanted the aisle seat. I'm already a nervous flyer. It scares me to fly that high and that fast on something that was built by the lowest bidder. And so I'm, I'm, I'm sitting here in the middle seat. A lady comes in, sits down to my right. A lady comes in, sits down to my left. I looked at him. I smiled, nodded, spoke. No response. And I knew in case of emergency, here's two people I can't depend on. <laughs> Somebody who will not smile at you will probably not help you find your flotation device. So I figured I may as well read. So I picked a magazine out of the pouch in front of me, just started reading, and I felt something on my left shoulder. Looked around, and the woman to my left, who would not speak to me, was now asleep <laughs> on my shoulder. I looked at her, and I found out she's one of these people that sleeps with her eyes open, rolled back in her head, and her mouth was wide open. And I looked at her and I thought, bless her heart. <laughs> I'm not saying she was ugly, but she was just barely pretty. <laughs> then I looked at her left hand and I realized she's married. Bless his heart. <laughs> and then I realized when a man wakes up early in the morning, takes that first look at his wife, he's half asleep, he's half awake, and in slow motion, he rolls over. <laughs> and he's thinking, whoo, she had a rough night. <laughs> if he'll just roll over and take another little nap, she'll get out of bed, fix herself up, and she'll look good. But I feel sorry for women. Because when a woman wakes up, looks at her husband, and he looks like a new definition for the word ugly, she may as well go ahead and get out of bed because that's as good as he gets. <laughs> <laughs>